Upwork has recently released a feature where you can boost your proposal when applying for a job. Some say it's worth it, some say it's not. In this video, I'm going to dissect all of that and give you my thoughts. In the beginning, when people apply for jobs on Upwork, what Upwork would do is they would use their own algorithm and sort the jobs based on best match, based on the criteria of the job proposal. And that's how it's done for a long time. Recently, they released a feature where now clients have the option to sort by many different options. So as you see over here right now, we have the option to sort by best match, newest applicant, oldest applicant, highest hourly rate, lowest hourly rate, and even highest earning. And now what's happened over here is Upwork has given the option for individuals to boost their profiles, no matter how the client sorts through the profiles, whether they want highest earning, the oldest one, or the, the, the one that, that charges the most, the three profiles that are boosted come out on top. For me personally, I feel boosting a profile has no merit or value whatsoever. And the reason being as follows. Number one, if you think about it, it gets very expensive. Recently, I purchased 300 connects for $45. And if you think about it, a lot of times individuals are applying for jobs now where they're boosting their proposal and rather than spending eight, 12 or 16 connects, now they're spending anywhere from 20 or 30 connects. So in this scenario, if they're spending 30 connects per proposal, and if you take to about 10 applications to get a job, that means hypothetically you're spending about $45 because if you do 30 connect times 10 jobs, that's 300 connect. And recently I spent $45 to get those 300 connect. That means you're spending at least $45 to get one job. Yes, I understand if you're a high paying individual, you can make up for that easily. But for someone who's starting out, I don't recommend that at all. Number two, what I noticed over here is that a lot of people who are at the bottom rungs who have not made an Upwork are more desperate to use this feature because they're hoping to get on top. However, the problem is they don't address the root cause. The root cause is that if your profile is not developed correctly, if you're not having the right certificate, if you're not having a profile picture that makes you professional, if you're not doing all the right things that you used to do with your profile first and how you're applying for a job second, it doesn't matter how much you boost your profile because the client is still, still going to go with the person that they feel is best. All that is doing for them is that it's putting it at the top so that, so that they have to look through your profile first in order to make the decision. But at the end of the day, if you don't stand out as an expert, it doesn't matter if they glance through your profile first, they're still going to go to the person that they feel is best. So it doesn't overcome bad profile. And number three, in my situation, what I would recommend is that you should only use once in a while. The reason why I recommend using once in a while is that if you find a job where you feel that you are directly aligned with the position itself and you feel very confident that this is the job for you, this just becomes an additional strategy in order to ensure that you get that job. That is it. But if you're doing this to overcome for the fact that you're not, you're struggling on Upwork number one, or the fact that you think this is what's going to get you that job and be the difference between you not getting jobs before and getting jobs, you're completely mistaken and it's a waste of money. But what I recommend over here, focus on your profile, focus on your skill and making sure you stand out as an expert and developing yourself as much as possible. And when you come into that situation where you feel that job is perfectly aligned for your skills and you need a little bit of extra boost in order to get to the right, uh, in order to get, uh, in order to catch the client's attention, use this feature. But other than that, don't waste your money on it. Instead, focus on applying for jobs regularly and naturally. And as you build yourself up, and as you start to make more money, you can invest in this feature to help you in the long run. But don't use it as a strategy in order to become successful.